no, 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 no. <laughs> Holy f <laughs> Bro, we are off. Off on our merry way. I know I say it every time, but I'm really not feeling this. Oh, we're on a lane. A lot of tree roots, bloody hell. Ah, oh, crap. In the 4x4 trail. Uh. Oh, bloody hell is this bike leaning over to the left? Probably me with my peg waiting. So Mike up, up ahead on the Fantic as well has taken two turns out of the preload on his rear shock. Now I took about a half a turn out last, uh, a few days ago. So it'd be interesting to get his opinion on his and my opinion on mine a little bit later. Oh crap and hell, come on. So my left hand grip is loose and I totally forgot about it again. Need to get the hand grip off, get some more glue in the boggy. Oh blimey that's sketchy that back end. So Mike ate a bush, <laughs> and I nearly ate a bush too. Oh God. I definitely ate that bush. Ow, dead leg. Let's get you turned off. It's definitely clay. Don't slip foot. <sighs> Need to get the goggles off, I can't see. Yeah, cheers man. <sighs> you absolute bastard bike. That's it, get some traction. Right, my hip is officially dead. I've got no real grip on my left side from A, my wrist, but B, now my glue's completely fucking gone and loose. I've, um, yeah, and then trying to pull the bike back up on that clay. The grip's totally gone now.
And we're off-roading again. Oh God, I've gone in the clay again. Stay out of the clay. Shit. It would be, you look at the log, you go to the log. I know you can't get it from the uh, video necessarily, but these are more like the hills of Surrey. These are not like Hearts, Beds, Bucks and, uh, and Leicestershire, that's for sure. Oh shit! Ah, that's a deep one. That's a foot off the pegs job. Don't get sprayed. Oh Jesus Christ, that stinks so bad. Wow, it's like night time in here. Got cocky jumping over the rut. That's what you get for being cocky, you nearly fall off. Because you can't see round corners. Uh. Oh, fuck it. This is gonna be hard work, I reckon. I highly don't recommend this if you've got a knackered wrist, guys. And a knackered uh, grip as well. It's like I figured the grip out, I've just got to hold on further forward and let it roll back until the Oxford heated grip cable grabs hold of it and then it can't go any further. Well, it can, but I guess the cable will break next. Whoa, there goes the back. Woo! Yeah, arguably I'm in too, too high a gear. Just look for the tyre marks. God, that's dark. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Yeah, you held it. Whew. If in doubt, power it out.
Oh, I'm not tall enough. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not strong enough a man handling that around. <laughs> you alright? Need a hand? Oh. Yeah. That is one low canopy. Oh. Come on, stay over that side, you bastard. Problem is, these hard tyres, they don't sort of contour, they don't... Like with the softer tyres, they, they stick to the side and they angle so you've got grip. Our hard enduro tyres don't. So you are literally running on the outside of the rim. Or outside of the outside of the tire even. And that's why the back end's sketchy. Because it's never got as much grip as the rest of the uh, rest of the guys. In my humble opinion. I'm probably gonna try a Oh shit. Fucking hell. I'm probably gonna try a trials tire next. A nice soft trials tyre. I don't know if you can run tubeless on that. Hopefully you can. Ooh. Man, my wrist hurts. I'm holding on for dear life here. This is a really beautiful part of the world. Like, really lovely. And now we are turning around. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Got too much purchase in the long grass. A bit of second gear. Pick the more shallow side. Ah, what a glorious morning for being out on the bike, eh? Shat it, you squeegee. Oh, that's a big one. Wow. I couldn't actually see that. The glare off it was so bright, all I could see was the sun shining in it. That's mucky. Whoa, that is so rocky. Morning. Oh man, how beautiful is this? Oh, you can't do this round my way.
I don't know if there's anywhere in the Chilton area of national beauty, the ALOB, that I can ride, but I mean, that's not exactly near me. I could maybe chuck the bike in the van before I go pick my boy up from school one day. Boy, that ain't a bad idea. That was beautiful. Doesn't <laughs> go anywhere like that round by me. Yeah. Nothing like it. We got some shitty little woods, but that's all. <laughs> oh shit! Hey! -hey. Them tricky little leaves. Really need to put on some muscle as well. Because I've got a bad back. And when you've got a bad back and no muscle. Thank you. <clears throat> yeah, when you've got a bad back and no other muscles to help. And my back muscles are well strong. They have to be. Otherwise I'm going to be able to bloody walk. Yeah, I've really got to work on my actual strength. Like, don't get me wrong, I think it's a relatively simple a job to get cardio fit, even just through walking. If you go out and walk every day, start off with a leisurely stroll, increase the distance, then up the pace, within a month you could be reasonably fit just walking if you went quickly. Anyone around here? Yeah, if you just up the pace. But strength training, that's different. You can do body weight training. You'll build muscle by doing press-ups and stuff. But again, unless you're adding weight, you're going to get stronger and the weight is going to get lesser, really. But I just don't like doing weights. I'd rather do it I don't know, carrying bricks or something as a builder. But that's not what I do as a job, so I can't do that. Wow, this rocky stuff sucks. <laughs> oh, big body puddles. Oh, there's a big rock in that one. Whoa. Oh, these are deep. Wet one. That last one was proper wet, wasn't it? Yeah, I decided to come alongside you when you went through it. The cover was going. Oh! <laughs> I've just wiped her and we stopped. Oh God! Holy fuck! It's gone over my face. Woo! That was a bit deep! I went fast! I wasn't fucking around, I was going for it! Now I can't see! Ah. It went everywhere! <laughs> Oh, 
clay clay and roots and wet goggles that was better I guess I'm warmed up a bit now oh those grips are nice and warm oh god Whoa, some of those roots are massive. And I can see very little. Sorry about that, I caught my boot on my own foot peg. Hey? Oh no, sorry, it wasn't you. I caught my foot trying to put it down. You was on camera! I caught my foot! Um, Typical, did the hard bit, went to put my foot down, uh. caught my heel on my foot grip, and down I went, like a fucking noob. Oh, I've got a hair up my nose. Oh, my gloves stink, yuck. Andrew wants to see how deep it is before he commits to it. Oh, that's not deep at all. Ready, pop it. Definitely gonna need an air filter after this one. Thank you. Look at that beautiful sun. Fucking hell, bike.
right in the kisser. <clears throat> no. I've got to get up. Ooh, gotta get up, gotta get out. Grab the world by the throat and shout. Buy it, sell it. The game's getting hard. Cause someone's stealing you and losing cards. Someone's stealing you and losing cards. Huh. That was good fun. And that is the benefit of sitting back. Because then you can do stuff like that. Without A, getting a mouthful of crap from the bike in front, or B, crashing into them. Leave yourself a nice gap. Good God. That definitely favours the shorter Pete, the shorter rider. That was a big one. Oh, Oxford hot grips. They'll turn you down a bit. Uh oh, that's come undone as well. That's come loose as well. This is a long lane. <laughs> Nearly did it. Get the old bum up out of the seat now. Let that bike dance. And we have arrived at the end. This is such a great place to ride. Look at that beautiful sun over that beautiful hill. Out of me mates, out of me pals. Cut up the countryside, having a blast. Oh, it's on deep. Oh, 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 oh. Why do I go so fast? Because I've heard the horror stories of people stopping in the water. And you don't know how deep it is, and I don't know how deep it is, so I'll go as fast as I am comfortable with, so that if I do bog, I've got enough momentum to carry me out. <sighs> can we hop that one? Yes, we can. Oh, I've gone blind. I wish I'd gone nose blind. Yeah, we'll have some of that. Oh yeah, get the weight back off the front wheel. Come on guys, get in the water. I'm gonna go for a little dip. Woo, lost it. Oh, penis puddle.
I'll be honest, the only bit that's not been fun so far was that first chalk, chalk, chalk clay hill with the rocks everywhere. That's why I called it chalk, I guess. That was not fun. Uh, I've never done that before, and now I have, and it was terrible. And I know we're going to have to do it on the way back. I just know we are. They're going to make me do it up and down, I reckon. I think I've already done it down, actually. Oh no, I did one down, not the one that we actually came off on there. Oh god, how did I not see that? See, that was the sun. I'm trying to keep my head up as high as I can get it without going blind. Wow. This is wet. That's a big drop. Could have jumped off that, I was in too high a gear. Oh, shit. Keep that bike, keep it going. Morning. Oh God, look at that bum. Oh, ho, ho. oh. I'm not gonna stay here. That's a mucky one. No Joe, I'm not riding up over the logs. Maybe one day. Not on this bike, I won't ever get over that. Either the bike would fall apart or the logs would all fall apart if I rode on it on this. Rocky Road? It's an actual road. Oh, we've been up here before, or down here even. Oh god, I've gone blind. Oh, this is a right bugger. This is sun through the gaps in the trees, bright. Oh, I shut my left eye and my nose will block it out. <laughs> and then I've got no depth perception. I definitely can't get too close now in case one of them falls off and I don't see them. Just close enough for the GoPro to see it though. So I'm picking a line, isn't it, when you can't see. Oh, skating towards the bushes. Whee! Crab, 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 crab. There's a sight, look at that. Six bikes in unison. What a team. Oh, hello, he's cross -rotted. I nearly did too. Foot full of mud. Clean that tyre off. Clean that tyre off. Oh, I'm going to have to get up now. This requires a finesse. Oh, that's some big rocks. Uh, big roots. Ooh, shit, that bike's moving. Could have done with clearing my boot out. Oh, no, it's night time. Half moon? Full moon. Ooh. Oh man, I've got to try and do contact lenses again. I obviously can't wear my glasses doing this. I'd have to... Although, I suppose if i got glasses that were big enough and covered enough of my face, I wouldn't need goggles. Then I could see, because I can't do contacts, I've tried it. It's brutal. It's more pain for me than it's worth. Oh. I'm genuinely worried about how little I can see. As if it's not the light, yes, the sun's a bit of a pain in the ass, but it's being able to pick out stuff in these leaves. It all just looks like leaves. Oh, till I get on it.
Is it break time? We're having a break. Lunch? Oh. Pardon me. Oh God, I've got that sun in my left eye again. I'll tell you what, we, did, we had a stop for about 20 minutes. Good God, my hip's sore now. Thank you. I wouldn't like having that around my neck either, mate. Sorry about that. Thank you. Naughty dog. See, it wasn't that he wanted to get away. Oh, shit. He just didn't want to be held by his neck. And she should have got off her bloody phone and dealt with him and held him properly and calmed him down and talked to him and stroked him take some of that excitement out of him oh shit <laughs> whoops ah Cross right at it. There we go. Fancy stopping for a breather. Very slippery wet one. And as we were talking at lunch, our little break, these sodding tyres, oh, they just climb. Because they're not soft, they don't conform to the shape, they just climb out. And obviously it climbed out. The front one did anyway. <laughs> and then I climbed in. I climbed in the bush. Vive la bouche! Yeah, I'm going to stand up. I'm not going to sit down. On that weight off the back wheel, on the front wheel. Guy told me that wasn't enduro. When you're in the slow bits and it's very wet and boggy, get your weight over the front, which I'm not doing now for some stupid reason. Oh yes, because my wrist hurts. <laughs> Do we risk going up here? Fucking back wheel nearly did it again then. Back wheel didn't like that, right? And he only has to blip that throttle a little bit. Yeah, he only has to blip that throttle a little bit and I get covered. Just jump. Oh, that is such good fun. Yep, power cable still connected. Mm. 
Let's go through the, the bog of eternal stench. Let's make it difficult for ourselves. Naturally pulling me to the left, so I'm going to go with it. Ooh. Shit. They were hard routes. But I can't get them. Oh, slimy, 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 slimy. Can't get a grip. Oh, this stuff's... Oh, no, no, no. I would do when I gone right down the fucking old one. Ha, didn't give me that time, did you? Little sucker. I would say as a camera person, and a vlogger and all that, I have grown quite extensively this past, uh, whatever it is, 10 months of dirt biking. I've got better camera set up, I've got better audio, video, understanding. So I've tried to put a bit more effort in, in the last couple of rides. I got carried away on the other one. This one predominantly because of the equipment I'm now using. Um, because I don't want mud all over the lens, I don't want guff audio all the time. Come on, come on, break free. Well, don't break free. I want to break free. I want to break free. There's a dog down here, wasn't there? I want to break free from your lies. You're so self satisfied. I don't know. Oh, God, who knows the words to that? Come on, Freddy, throw me a freaking bone here, man. Oh, that is not going to work. I've tried this before going along the, the outside top edge of a rut. And I always end up in the rut. Oh, I didn't end up in the rut this time though. Yeah! Woohoo! Check me go you! It's all clicked. Like most of my joints. I can't see! Oh shit balls! I can't see! <laughs> there were some good whoops down here from what I remember. Oh, let's get out of the seat. Oh, yeah. Cleared that one. Oh, okay. Tight section. Thank you. Hiding like a little hiking ninja. Afternoon. Oh, we got a Ford. Oh, he nearly lost that then. Straight into a lane. This is like a hard one. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, is anyone there? Hello? <laughs> we should get beepers. Not like parking sensor beepers, but like a beeper for the bike in front of you so you can hear it but not necessarily see it. This looks familiar. Ah, he says that. No, it is actually. I say that every single time. This looks familiar. It's a green lane. Of course it looks familiar. It's English flipping countryside, isn't it? Oh. Okay, this is this is rooty, rutty, and rocky, and chalk, obviously. It's actually going to shake my bones off of my skin. Uh, off of my uh, no, hold on. Shake my skin off of my bones, there you go. Can't shake my bones off my skin. Flesh, that's it. It's gonna shake my flesh off of my bones. Oh god. Oh I have to say by as well, these former boots, whatever they're called, if I remember I'll link to them in the description below, are phenomenal. They are so comfortable. And they're clearly waterproof, like proper waterproof, not like my RST Adventure 2 WPs, whatever they were called, WP standing for waterproof. Actual fact, not waterproof in the slightest. Unless it was a part of the boot I wasn't using that was waterproof. Not like my motocross boots though, they're definitely not waterproof in the slightest. Apart from when water's trying to get out. Third gear, monsieur, with these gears you're really spoiling us. I'm just getting fed up of listening to the engine going. Oh, there goes my knee again. You don't. Don't spin that wheel up, this stinks. Oh good god, that stinks. Jesus Christ. Beep beep! Get up! <laughs> we can't stall it, he's got a recluse. <laughs> oh, that's a foot peg getter. that power 28 horsepower is plenty for green lanes I'd rather be riding without such bright sun like my eyes but I fully appreciate the benefits of having that sun oh shit and so I will put up with it but I'll still mow oh oh no 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 there we go in it and out of it power come on baby come on baby lug it up in third lug it up you're a little beauty you really are didn't have to work you too hard, didn't have to rev the tits off you. Let's have a bit of second gear. I can't see. Water. More water. More water. Ooh. Keep it going, keep it going, keep that clutch. What's occurring? 
Well, they're not going through that big puddle. I'm going through that big puddle. Oh shit, that rot's horrible. It's a rot on a bank. Good, see his headlight. That's gone into neutral. Those ones with the flat sides are brilliant. Because the tyres don't try and climb out of those. So the ones that are slightly chamfered, they're the ones. Well, we've got a waggy tailed little jack up ahead. Thank you. All right, doggo. I mean, that's steep. <laughs> Wasn't sure if that was a road or not. Hello, is this a road? It is indeed. That was a nice car driver. Hello everybody. Hello Dr. Nick. This little bastard is fighting me, fighting me, fighting me, fighting me. But guess what? It's stronger than me. I just got better technique. <laughs> Get myself out of it with the technical tricks. Oh, that's rocky. Oh, shibbles. GoPros suck for descent, for perspective. And this one. Oh, I can hop that one. Yeah. And that one. Oh god, that's it, thumb's gone. No more hopping. And if you've got on a chair beast fender pack on your bike, check and see if your headlight works. His KTM does. Oh, nearly went. Yeah, his KTM does. Because his headlight's higher. Mine, however, isn't. Oh god. Why are you all why are you all stopping, you buggers? <laughs> yep, that's slippy. We had a crash, have we? Yeah. <sighs> Luckily, it's not a handguard, but did you see that? No. <laughs> what happened? The fence post sticking out there has smacked it on the handguard. Oh shit. <laughs> I just managed to stop down here. But... Yeah, to be honest, I thought I was going to crash into you then. <sighs> I thought I was just going to slide straight into the pair of them. <laughs> <laughs> This stuff's dirty. This was this is chalk, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, I thought this was clay. That was chalk on the first hill as well, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, oh no 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 not again, you motherfucker! <laughs> Fucking hell, caught my foot on the foot peg again. Thinking about my goggles. So Andrew has just had an off down here, crashed into a fence panel by all or fence post by all account. Jesus, where are they gone? 
Can you stop to put my goggles on? Norman uh, disappeared off somewhere. We don't know where. I'm cold and stiff now. We've been sat for about 15 minutes, I think. Heading back now because it's starting to the light starting to fade. Very low, low sun, uh, and Andrew's just had an off. Uh, so we're taking the roadway home, I believe. I say home, back to the van. Then I've got three hours in the van. I'm right down the M3, so I might go out, uh, head to the A34, head up to Newbury Bypass. <clears throat> we are back. It's very sunny still. All the other guys are parked down there. I'm obviously parked here. Right. Thanks for watching. <laughs> See you in the next one.